guys, Andy Waffles here, doing a quick review on a pickup that I just made. There you go. I got it from Nordstrom. CDGs right there. And put a message to myself. <laughs> Congrats on reaching 1k subscribers. Bunch of other shit, so let's get started with this pickup. <laughs> All right, so let's get started. Really good quality box. Great quality shoe. I personally don't really like at all wear Converse. Maybe when I was a little kid, I'd wear them. But recently, I haven't <clears throat> at all. So this is my first pair in like years. And it's just cause they're CDGs, you know, they different. Plus the quality on them higher. Good ass quality. Just from looking at them, we could tell quality's right on. Look at that, that shine. I got the whites cause they look better. I don't know. I might cop the black ones too. <clears throat> Really comfortable shoe, it seems like. <clears throat> I only tried them on. So this shoe's all quality right here. Really quality. The quantity. They do run uh, bigger, so you do have to size down. This is like paint, it's like painted on her. Screen printed, I'd say. I've been wanting these for a while, just that they sold out. They always sell out, so. If you guys really want a pair, you guys should go get them before they all sell out. They're always selling out in Nordstrom. I did get them for 120, but worth your money pretty cheap for a shoe honestly like if you buy Jordans you could easily buy some CDGs so here let's do a quick detail on the box same exact thing and these are the high tops these go for 125 so they're five dollars more See the thing I just noticed right now, right off the bat, these don't have the little Converse star, the off star. These do. I'm not sure if the seal is only on the high tops. Like I said, I don't, I don't wear Converse, so I wouldn't know this. But here you go. Quick review on this. Yeah, it's a quality spot on. Good. I 
itu gitu Look at that glare. Nice glare right there. Um, these are like more of a cream white. CDG tags. That's all it comes with, nothing too crazy. Besides the quality of the shoe. I think it's pretty crazy. side by side comparison <clears throat> Check out the inside That was about the same. There's like a... I don't know. It seems like a padding, but like I said, I don't wear a Converse, I wouldn't know, so... These are really comfortable. So besides... Pretty much the same, obviously, low tops. Uh, besides the star, the Osseo star. Same tags as well, obviously. Got the CDG play. It tells you how to like take care of the uh, the screen printing on the heart. I believe it is screen printed. Uh, it's sprinted, sprinted, printed. <clears throat> so I guess it is screen printed. So yeah, so it tells you how to take care of it. Uh, I mean, honestly, there's really nothing much to say about these shoes besides qualities on point. They're really clean. They're really, you know, simple. They're not too loud. They're not too crazy. They're, you know, they're your average 
type of shoe that you would like to wear. <clears throat> you know, you see everyone wearing Converse and you just be that one person walking around with Converse with a fucking little heart on the side. You know what I mean? Like, and then the quality, like you could tell this is quality right away. Like, there's some uh, Converse that do, they do make some Converse that I'm aware of that make higher quality. <clears throat> but just walking down the street seeing this, this is obviously definitely gonna catch some attention. They're just like, you know, they're clean, they're not too loud. They're not too crazy, you know, they're just simple. It doesn't say CDG or anything. You just have to know your brands, and if you know your brands, you know what's up. This one is fucking sick. I like how the heart looks bigger and everything, obviously, because it's, a, it's on a high top. But the high, the eye, the, I mean the eye, the heart's definitely a lot bigger. Seems like to me. I mean, if I was to see someone walking down with these, definitely catch my attention. <clears throat> but like I said, you know, nice, simple, clean shoe, nothing too loud, nothing too crazy. Good quality. They seem comfortable. Uh, definitely will be doing probably later on in the future if it's a good day. And if I do, I'll let you know how the shoes work out, but. Anyways, thanks for 1K subs. Really appreciate it right there. Go get more views on my last video though. My unboxing on Pink Dolphin. But anyways, good shit's coming up this year. More reviews, more pickups. I am setting up my room right now. Because I do make my my uh, videos in my living room. And it fucking sucks because I have to do them in the daytime. Because of lighting and everything but I should be who I am I mean actually I am <clears throat> I'm working on my room right now setting up my room she should look fucking clean as fuck and by what I mean like clean as fuck I'm not saying that it's they're actually not I take that shit back my fucking room is a mess I did clean it up yesterday though my room is a mess but I'm trying to organize that shit more you know um, so I can be able to make more videos I'm gonna do a little set up in there <clears throat> just instead of me holding the camera all the fucking time i hate doing this like i really do not get like good angles or any of that shit but i mean actually yeah, i do i mean i get the pov action going on but besides that like i really hate holding the camera and then doing the review with one hand and all that shit like it's a lot so like hopefully I should be setting up my room soon. Should be looking nice to make some videos in, good lighting, good everything. And I should be having a tripod set up <clears throat> facing my way. So I won't have to be doing this uh, point of view perspective shots. But I mean if you guys like this perspective shots instead, like, let me know. But my shit is going to be Just hold on tight. <clears throat> a lot more shit coming soon. I don't know, comment down below what you want to see me pick up next. I might pick up some, some Balmain, some Balenciagas. We'll, we'll see what happens, honestly. We'll just see what happens as time goes by. But <clears throat> Anyways, I just want to say thanks to everyone who supports me, everyone who fucks with me, and everyone who doesn't fuck you too. All the haters. You know. Either way, though, um, go add me on Snapchat. I will be having a lot of shit there, like, I do show a lot of shit there, I'm gonna be showing more, like, more of my videos and stuff. Like, behind the scenes, like, I'll do behind the scenes and shit, so, you know, make sure to add me on Snapchat. <clears throat> and as well, add me on Instagram. Add me on Instagram, so, follow me, you know, stay tuned. A lot of my shit there, I'm gonna be posting on my social media with my videos and stuff and whatnot, so make sure to follow me there. Make sure to subscribe if you're new to my channel and if you fuck with my shit. Thumbs up on my videos, you know. Anyways, I talk so fucking much, but I just wanna say thank you to everybody who fucks with me. Good luck, thanks for 1k.